Hey guys, Jamal the Asian Gamer here. Welcome to another video where today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to gen wards. Now this is a very useful base defense for factions uh, where you can basically build multiple wards around your base really quickly and efficiently. So what you're going to need is some cobblestone, some lava buckets and some water buckets. That is all you need to gen wards. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to get your chosen blocks. I'm choosing cobblestone for this demonstration. So what you're going to do is you're going to build all the way to world limit, uh, usually that would be 255, but just for the demonstration I'm going to build up to Y12. Okay, next thing you want to do is you want to break all the blocks underneath the top one, just to make sure that um, the lava flow isn't weird once you've placed it. Alright, then you're going to build out your wall as far as possible and as long as possible all the way around your base. So then you get your lava package and you want to place them underneath each cobblestone block. Once you've done that, you want to wait for the lava to gen in. Uh, this is so the cobblestone genning doesn't really mess up once you place the water, because what it can do is miss spots so your gen rewards won't be fully complete. So you're going to get your water buckets, and instead of placing them underneath, you want to place them on top, just like so. And once you've done that, the cobblestone should automatically gen in. Now, as you can see, this is literally a hundred times faster than building them yourself. Uh, they've already finished, actually. Um, and you're going to leave the water on top just so they're water protected. You want to protect your corners. Um, and what I would suggest is to replace these bottom blocks with slabs. Uh, what this will do is basically just make it so that your wall is um, able to defend itself against sand raids. Um, it makes it a lot harder for people to stack sand, uh, which is obviously very useful for your base. That's going to be at the end of this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please suggest more tutorials for me to do in the comments below, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.